Hello. Why am I turning? All right, anyway, this is Bunker Hill. Uh, why am I here? Because I need to go here, which should be behind me and to the river, uh, across the river, I should say, for a quest. Plus, I said, well, I guess this is Bunker Hill. Thought I'd look around here a little bit, maybe. I thought there was uh, people selling stuff, but. Look, I'm trying to relax. I've been on the road a long time. Load a little heavy there? I'll buy anything you don't need and sell everything you do. Uh, let's see what you got. Let's see what you got. You got the caps, I got the goods. This is Deb. Do I have the caps? I need these bad. She doesn't have... I can buy cement. What, what was the other stuff I was looking for? Um, weapons, apparel, ooh, black ops, haha, <laughs> wow, that's some good stuff there, metal chest piece 12, what do I have now? Um, I see that's 14, so that's more. One on a stick, burnt aluminum can, aluminum oil. What was I missing? I can't remember now. No, well, I know it was aluminum. Anyway, I can't go there right now, anyway, so it's not a big deal. Uh, see, I really don't have a whole lot to sell. Miscellaneous junk. That's value one. Ooh. Copper I need. Screws I need. What can I get out of a gold watch? But I'm going to sell it. Get my cost down a little bit anyway. Ammo, <coughs> excuse me, I really don't have, right now I'm using, I uh, should have, but these don't have weight, so it doesn't matter. I have two army helmets, I guess I can get rid of one. Am I carrying any junk clothes? Ooh. What is Reginald suit? Yeah, let's get rid of that. Um, now I'm gonna keep that a little while. Well, I'm wearing has. Okay, I'm gonna get rid of it because I need the caps. All right, uh, R to accept. Firm tab out. Wonder what he's got. Hey, at least it's honest work. Hey, got the best armor in these parts. Um, sure. Let's take a look. Focus on stopping power. Pretty, don't stop bullets. All right. Let's check out your apparel. That's not too bad. I need to bring my apparel up so I can see what I'm doing. Uh, that was cushioned. <laughs> Combat armor, right leg. That's eight. That's eight. 
um, 8 and 4. That's 8 and 8. Okay, that's a little bit better. That's 14. What's my chest piece now? 14. That's the same. Ooh. Yeah, $15,000. Or caps. Uh, not really. No, I think I'm going to say thanks anyway. All right, let's head for where we were going. I've got a little more 45 ammo, so that's that's a good thing. And we should be headed in this direction, I hope. Maybe we can get there without a whole lot of trouble. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, here's the bridge. I guess it's not going to take me long to get there. Unless I, well, look for mines, I guess. Uh, I don't even know what gun I got. Super mutants? You don't hide behind. Oh, where'd they go? Fuck, gun it. Super Mutants Orders. Uh-oh. You know what? I think they're after me. Hey, that's different. I'll have to check that out. Uh, where would that be? Inventory data? No. Inventory, uh, miscellaneous, super RS, super mutant orders, kill, loot, return, for who, okay. I guess that means they just have basic orders then. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Back on... On task. Oh, did I search him? Yeah. Probably should have taken the Meyer look me, but that's alright. Now I need to see... Where I am... Oh yeah, almost there. Blast... Oh, see, and I had a radio signal too. Um, Silver Shroud. Calling all Silver Shroud fans. I got an urgent mission. If you're a true fan, stop by the memory den and to talk to Ken Conley. The Silver Shroud needs you. Huh. The Silver Shroud. Talk to Kent Conley. I think I'm... Oh, come on. Come on, you're a little mini car. Jeez. Okay, I'm loaded. I've got too many, um...
Alright, he should be right over here. Eleven. Oh, there it, there it is. The Cabot House. I'm here to talk to Jack Cabot. Oh, it's you. Good. Come on in. I hate to say it, but that sounds like... What's his name from... Um, Point Lookout. <laughs> I hope not. I don't think I'm armed up enough. We'll see. Come on. Let's go meet the boss. Okay. Lead on. You couldn't just do it. I had to tell you. Uh, let me put my gun away. Jack, the new guy is here. One moment, one moment. You just have to. Oh. He'll be right with us. <coughs> oh, damn. Clearly, I'll just the mixture. Hello, hello. Welcome to Cabot House. I'm Jack Cabot. All right. <laughs> that was a weird way of walking down the stairs. Uh, what is this place? What is this place? This is my ancestral home. The Cabots have always lived here, since long before the Great War. If you're asking what we're still doing here, with Boston in its current sad state, well, that's a story for another time, perhaps. All right. Pleased to meet you, Jack. And I am very pleased to meet you. Edward finds it tiresome. But I always like to know personally everyone who works for me. Please, have a seat. How about a drink? Edward, the good bourbon, eh? Please, have a seat. Am I supposed to sit down? Now, before we get down to business, I have a question I like to ask all my new employees. All right. Don't interrupt, Edward. The question is this. Do you believe there is other intelligent <laughs> life in the universe? Um... Are you talking about aliens? UFOs and little green men? No, no. That's all popular hysteria. I doubt any of it has any basis in fact. <coughs> I'm talking about the hidden history of our planet. The very origins of human civilization. Ancient powers that modern science, even at its pinnacle, could barely begin to comprehend. Um... You think aliens created human civilization? Yes, if by alien you mean a non-human precursor to the commonly understood founding cultures, Sumer, Egypt, Assyria. My father excavated a city in the Rub al Khali in Arabia, which he dated to more than 4,000 years before the rise of any known human civilization. The structures and artifacts were strange, disturbing even, clearly not constructed for or by humans. I've spent my life trying to decipher what he uncovered. Jack, can I tell him what I need him to do? I'm sorry, Edward. I just get carried away sometimes. <laughs> You're sending him to look for the missing shipment? Yeah. Well then, I'd better leave you to it. We'll talk more about this some other time, when things are less rushed. It isn't important now. Welcome to the family. Okay. You're officially hired. Congratulations. <sighs> What was all that about? Don't worry about it for now. That's part of the job, by the way. It's best to keep an open mind. Jack may be eccentric, but he's definitely not crazy. The job I got for you is simple. Jack owns a facility north of the city. There's an important package that went missing between there and here. I need you to track it down and bring it back to me. 
Any questions? Um, for starters, what's this package I'm looking for? It's a metal case holding vials of serum. You don't need to worry about what it is. Jack needs it for his research. That's all you need to know. You should start at Parsons State Insane Asylum. Don't let the name spook you. It's just a secure building that we're using. We think the courier got ambushed as he was leaving the place. The guards heard gunfire in the distance, but we don't know exactly what happened. Check in with Maria at Parsons. She's in charge of the security force there. She can point you in the right direction. You all set then? Okay. Yep. I'll see you soon with the package. Good luck. Don't get killed on your first job. <laughs> first job? Alright, now, how do you get out of here? Oh, there. <laughs> um, yeah, it's time. I'll go outside first. And listen to this robot tell me not to step on whatever grass there was. I didn't see any. Anyway. We may go check out this other radio broadcast too if it's not too far away. Let me see where all these places are. That's a noisy robot. Worse than my dog. Alright, here we go. <clears throat> wow, that's way up there. How gum. Okay, let's see where this other one is. Silver, silver, silver shroud. Let me close that one for now and close this one for now so we can just... This one's not too far away. I thought I remembered... Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's just, just down the street. All right, we'll go there and check out that. See what that's going to be about. But for now, I'll see what this robot's going to do now. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.